searching, perhaps looking for his next victims. He calls down the stairwell to his fellow gunman. Is he the lookout, checking the storeroom is clear before calling the others up? They certainly don't seem to be in a hurry as they move almost casually and calmly through the building. The video shows it's past five o'clock Kenyan time and the siege at Westgate Mall has been going on for six hours by this time. The Kenyan authorities initially said there were 10 to 15 attackers, but these pictures appear to show a maximum of four men. This image inside the Nakumat supermarket shows the same gunman wandering through the aisles and past abandoned shopping trolleys. The CCTV clock indicates it's an hour earlier, around four o'clock, but already they've shot and killed dozens and brutally maimed many others. In this second image, the man in the light-coloured top appears to be on his mobile phone, perhaps taking instructions. They're all carrying AK-47 guns and backpacks which appear full, perhaps loaded with their ammunition. And in another image taken inside the supermarket, you can clearly see the face of the gunman. These pictures will be crucial in helping to track down those who knew these men and who can help Interpol and the Kenyan authorities build a profile of them. Amateur footage taken as the attack is happening shows the chaos and fear. It's in stark contrast to the apparent indifferent and nonchalant attitude of the killers as they wandered through the mall. In this other footage, the camera is focused on the supermarket tills. The gunman is in the top left of the screen, apparently randomly vandalising the area, knocking computers off the counters. He's wandering along the checkout tills, but it's only when he's much closer to the camera that you can see he's on his mobile phone too. He's holding his weapon in his right hand. Again, he too seems very unhurried. No sign he's worried about being challenged by police or soldiers. And all this time, those inside the mall and still alive were desperately trying to get out, not knowing when the gunman would shoot.